I'm done. I'm not going to make any more blockchain tutorials. I spent so much time cranking out massive amounts of value, educating you all on this revolutionary, highly lucrative new technology, and nobody cares. At least that's what the YouTube algorithm thinks. See, whenever I put out a new tutorial and nobody clicks on it, then YouTube doesn't show it to anybody. And if nobody watches it, then it causes my channel to die. And it will die if we don't do something about it. So that's why I need your help. All right, so if you're just tuning in for the first time, this might be a little bit awkward for you, but let me explain. So I'm Gregory, and on this channel, I teach you how to become a blockchain master. And I've put out hundreds of free blockchain tutorials on this channel that show you how to become a blockchain developer step by step. And lately, no one's been watching them, and my channel has been dying. So I'm done unless we can convince YouTube to show those videos to more people. So here's how you can help if you want to see more blockchain tutorials. Number one is you can smash the like button down below. And two, also subscribe to this channel and keep doing that every time I put out a new video. And if I ever do these tutorials again, then I need to know what you want to see. So comment down below. So yeah, I don't know what to do, everybody. I know this is a little bit of an awkward conversation, but it had to be done if we're going to save this channel and educate more people about blockchain. And since we're already talking about, you know, family business, then don't forget the Flash Flow Masterclass is happening very soon on June 10th. So if you want to learn to trade millions of dollars in cryptocurrency without actually having to own a million dollars yourself, then click the link down below to sign up right now. I don't have a tutorial for you today and who knows when I'm going to make any more tutorials. I want to answer a question that people ask me all the time. So I figured I would just do it right here on YouTube and settle it once and for all. And that's basically this. Can you become a real world blockchain developer by just teaching yourself or do you need a fancy degree? So the answer is no, you definitely don't need a degree. And you can certainly teach yourself. And what I mean by that is basically you can acquire professional level skills with online learning resources like the ones I put on this channel and learn on your own outside of a traditional setting. And that's one of the reasons that kind of bums me out that people aren't watching more of these tutorials uh, because this is such a groundbreaking technology. And if I was starting over myself, this is definitely what I would be learning. There are so many blockchain developers making a killing doing this. They're making so much money. Pretty much anybody who has these skills just gets snatched up instantly. There's such a huge demand shortage for developers. And I've done a bunch of videos on my channel recently that prove this. So check out the video I did with Ben. He got his first blockchain developer job with zero programming experience. And then also check out the video with Jesse. He helped build a $17 million cryptocurrency exchange as a self-taught programmer. These people taught themselves from scratch and they're absolutely crushing it. So of course you can teach yourself today, like nobody is stopping you. And the crazy thing about blockchain is you can build your own applications right now that handle millions of dollars in transactions without anybody's permission. You can just get started today. You don't need to be approved by anybody. All you need is programming knowledge that you can find on this channel. And if you've watched this channel for a while, you know I'm a big fan of online learning resources for a few reasons. One, they're cheaper. And two, you can learn all the relevant skills so much faster than the traditional route. So trust me, I don't have a computer science degree myself. I didn't go to a coding boot camp. In fact, I got rejected from coding boot camp. I didn't even get in. All right, but I stuck with it and I'm so glad that I did. I just taught myself from scratch and it paid off big time. And I used online learning resources to do it. All right, and that's one reason I'm a huge believer in it is because they've worked for me and I've watched them work for so many other people. All right, and that's one of the big reasons I created the Blockchain Developer Bootcamp in the first place. It's the ultimate learning resource that I wish I had when I first started. And it's actually inspired by a big program that I took when I first started programming. I wanted to make something where people didn't have to know anything about blockchain when they started and also didn't have to know any programming language before they started so that they could you know, learn everything step by step to build their own real world project and land a high paying job. And that's exactly what it does. You know, I've had people graduate from the boot camp who, who have done that. I mean, check out that video I did with Chris recently. He didn't know anything about blockchain when he first started and now he's absolutely crushing it. He built his own blockchain-based options trading platform that he's turning into a real-world business. And he had this idea, didn't know how to program, didn't really know how the blockchain worked, took the boot camp and just built it. And that's why blockchain is so crazy right now. All right. And so it's really easy to look at results like this and say, oh, I can't do that. Or these people are just smarter than me. Trust me, you don't have to be a genius to do this. Like, guess who isn't a genius? Me. I'm not special. When I first learned blockchain, it was hard. And that's because I had to learn it on my own. 
I had to you know scour the web looking for learning resources because they didn't really exist. And that's one of the biggest reasons I created this channel for you all. So I'm not a genius, but I do learn things a little bit differently than other people. And that's just from having a lot of experience you know, learning things. And I've reverse engineered this process to help other people learn too. And I want to describe that right now so you know that you can benefit from it if you're trying to teach yourself programming and especially blockchain. When I learn things, I like to jump straight into the deep end rather than having everything spoon fed to me. I believe this is better for a few reasons. Number one, it's faster. And number two, it's more exciting. So what would this look like in terms of programming? Well, basically, it would look like trying to build an, an entire application without knowing the programming languages. And this is counterintuitive to the way most people try to learn programming because they think like, how could I build an application if I don't even know the programming languages? Most people think they need to master the coding language itself before they go try to build an app. But this is the wrong way to learn. Here's why. If you've never programmed before, then you don't have any context you have no idea why, like what you're learning, how it applies to actually building an actual app. And second, you won't have purpose. You'll just be learning a programming language and not really sure why you're learning it. You don't really know how the things that you're learning are, are serving a bigger purpose. So this is kind of like trying to put together a jigsaw puzzle without seeing the box, right? So imagine you had all these puzzle pieces, but you didn't know what they were for. You're just trying to put things together, but you don't actually see a picture that you're trying to build toward. So that's why the other way is better. If you have an app that you're trying to build and you're putting all the pieces together, you're learning about programming as you go and you see the purpose that you're working toward. So when you take this other approach, the better approach, you will have context, all right? And you will have purpose. See, so you'll actually learn the programming languages as you go. And this will make everything stick so much better because you're learning programming to do a very specific thing, to build this one app. And when you have this context, you know, you're way less likely to forget. So for example, if you're trying to learn what an array is and you just take a coding course to teach you JavaScript by itself and, you know, you learn this is what an array is. It just contains a list of items, you know, and you just see numbers. Well, great. What can you actually do with this array? You have no idea how that connects to building an application. But if you try to build an app, like a decentralized cryptocurrency exchange, for example, that has an order book, and you learn that you can use an array to store all the orders in there, and you can use objects to track the buy price and the sell price of an order, then that's going to really teach you a lot about what an array is and why you can use it in the context of programming. And that's why it's way better. So yeah, you know, this second way of, you know, kind of teaching everything as you go, it's a little more haphazard and less structured. And it's kind of like uh, painting with a splatter technique. You know, you use a paintbrush and you flick paint onto a canvas and, you know, just a little bit of paint gets on there every time and it's not in a very structured manner, but eventually it covers the entire canvas. And it's the way that I like to learn. It's the way I teach other people to learn because it, it works, plain and simple. All right, I've seen lots of people get results this way and I'm a big believer in this. All right, so that's all I've got. And don't forget, the Flash Flow Masterclass is coming up very soon. It's on Wednesday on June 10th. So if you want to learn to trade millions of dollars in cryptocurrency without actually needing a million dollars yourself, then sign up with the link down below. This really might be the next big trend in blockchain. And so I don't know when I'm going to do this again, and you don't want to miss out. Right? I've been running blockchain for a long time, and these opportunities, they don't stick around forever. I remember when you used to be able to buy Bitcoin for $100 and I missed out on that opportunity. So don't be like me. Sign up right now, link down below. And remember, if you want to save this YouTube channel and see more blockchain tutorials, then you need to smash the like button and subscribe for the YouTube algorithm. And better yet, go watch some of those tutorials. You can find them on my YouTube homepage. They're pretty much like Udemy courses, but they're totally free. And if you like what you see and you want to build a real world blockchain app and become a highly paid blockchain developer, then I can show you how to do that step by step inside the blockchain bootcamp. You can head on over to dappuniversity.com forward slash bootcamp to get started right now. And don't worry, you don't have to know the programming languages. You don't have to know anything about blockchain. I can show you from scratch. All right, that's all I've got. And until next time, thanks for watching Dapp University.